Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Aries for love and relationship for the month of July Working on a business, it is working on a business to become wealthy. You want money, you want to pay your bills, you want to be really able to have money. This is working on a wealth, working on a business, working on a future between you and someone also. The other person I get here that they want positive communications between you and them. And I get here they are seeking uh, a settle down or a relationship with you. But I get here that he or she into themselves at this time. Some of you are working on your credit also because I get here it's complicated a little bit and you need to adjust it. You need to find the balance in your life like you are working on it too. Some bills, credit cards, anything like you know, from the past, I get here that you need to pay the bills. Um, adjusting credit card, adjusting credit. You have like you know, some debts from before and I get here you are working on it and you are for it. It's going to happen, it's going to work for you. Someone in a relationship with you, I get here they want a future with you and I get here they have been really looking into themselves because they have a business also or they have work. And I get here they are reach, trying to reach a goal with their career and business in their life. And I get here that they have been really hurting and not progressing with their business before. It's complicated for him or her. But I get here that the progress in their hands because they have been really doing some bad choices in work or career. And I get here that they are trying to correct it. You want really success for yourself and I get here you are seeking success. So it's a great start right now like you now with looking into your career yourself, dear heirs. Another person like you know, the other person that who is in, in relationship with you, I get here they are happy, they are trying to be some of people like you no know, doing Advertisement for their business. They have been busy and I get here you feel like you know, that this coldness coming from that person. An air sign person. You have really like you know, just trying to change your life with this air sign person. Mostly I'm picking on an air sign person. There is an earth sign person also, like, you know, in the picture for you. But an air sign, it could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. They want their financial freedom, mostly. They are happy with you in general. And I get here seeking marriage. This person like you know, in your relationship have been really like you know, changing a lot in their life, like you know, according to other people from their past, walked away from it, changing their life. There is a change. That resemble like you know, someone who was married and get divorced and they want really a new relationship with you or like a committed relationship with you. Someone who was really like you know, in a relationship that never get anywhere and they change their direction. And they are trying to really like you know, just... Uh, um, trying to get to cut loose ends in their life with other people that they are bringing drama more than happiness trying to isolate or th those people for them to be with you and this is really a good sign here 
That person I get here, they are free finally from someone from their past. Yes, I get a divorce here. And I get here that they just want to be free and happy from that person because they cause them too much drama, yes. And it's sometimes it's not just a divorce, you know. You could be like, you know, in a committed relationship with someone, you don't want to deal with them. You are free at last. Things are like, you know, have been really resolved. You need to change something in you. Something that you keep really like you know, checking internet, phone, uh, messages. Stop. You need to stop because these are the bad choices you are making. What you need to get ahead in your life like you know, with that person at this time and don't look at other things because that person is trying their best to be with you and you are still stuck on some people like you know, that they know already a long time ago. They text that person, they phone them, they did this. You need to stop and free yourself. Free yourself from all of these so I can really struggle and chaos because it hurts you more and it doesn't make you progress with that person. You need to be happy. You're going to be happy if you really let yourself be happy because looking and checking after someone, it doesn't make you happy. It makes you miserable. You don't want to be miserable. And you bring your misery on the, other per on the person that you are with. And you argue. You fight that way. It's not good. Someone says here that, you know, a great start. They walked away from someone who is really lazy, not someone on their side. That's not you. But I get here this person is trying to be with you. You have to let go other people like, you know, that you think about from your past for yourself like, you know, that. They don't do you any good anymore. Because if you are like, you know, having a little conflict with your person and you're going to go and get like, you know, someone from your past, why you want to do that? Solve your problems, face it, and instead of really like you know, just going backwards to the past, because someone from your past is not going to do you any good at all. The other person in your life, they take it in a good sense of humor. If you check on them or spy on them, you want them. They like it. They like it because you, they see that you will keep coming in that way. There is money for you is coming. And I get here that you don't trust it. You have to trust your business. If you are starting a business or a job, you have to trust it for you to succeed in it. Because if it's there, but you don't trust it yet, when you trust it and trust in the universe that is going to work for you, you will succeed and win. You are moving forward. I see that. You feel like you know, that you are not too reliable for the business that you are in. But you should be really reliable. You should be really like, you know, just be on target. Do not stop. Don't, do not quit. This is the time that you prove yourself. Unless there are some obstacles, you need to solve it and go on with it. Your person is making wishes and plans with you. They are coming through to you. And I get here coming through because they know that you are the actual one in their life. And I get here that they have a really a good intention for you. You feel that this person cannot really continue, but I get here they do. It's like you make a problem without there is a problem. There is no problem. So you are having that okay or wink from your angels to keep on going. Like the luck is opening for you. Just keep on going positively. Do not talk to sit there and... Try to look around you. Perhaps there is a problem. I have to look into it. There isn't. Okay. Your person is loyal to you, but they are disappointed all the time, like you know, when you really keep really telling them that they have someone else or want someone else. And I get here, they want you. They want to be with you. But you have to trust this person a little bit. Little bit more. You don't have to trust all the way. Because you don't, you are not going to trust all the way. I know that. But you are going to be really like, you know, just making a really good relationship and financial for both of you. Like, 
when you want to even like you know, really proceed with your finances, do not wish the other person to fail in their finances so they will want you or need you. What you need to do, like you know, that, God bless, you know, wish them good luck. Wish your person good luck, like you know, in their money situation. So because whatever you send out, you know, it comes back at you. It's really something better that way. You kind of like, you know, just feel that they are not going to succeed. You cannot do that. It's really a bad karma for you. I know that you want to be really a big help. You want to work a lot. You want to really like, you know, just look for a brighter future for you and your person. And I get here, you got it. There is no problem. Just keep on going positively. It's really best for you that way. Dear Aries, I hope you enjoyed the reading. And if you need a private reading, please contact me. And the link for my website is below this video, mysticalaziza.com. When you click on my website, click on reading prices. After you purchase your reading, please give me a call. And the phone number is listed on my website. A lot of you send me an email and say, I want a private reading. Okay, I'm going to email you with the same thing I said in the video. Click on my website. Go to my website, mysticalaziza.com. Click on reading prices. Purchase your reading. Then call me. And if you are uh, overseas or a long t uh, distant, you can use WhatsApp. Or if you have an iPhone, you can call me on um, FaceTime audio. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.